I mean, it's raining out, it's muddy out. I just told them they weren't made of sugar. Get up there and run. <laughs> That's easier said than done when your run is literally straight up a ski hill on a cold, wet morning. But over 450 people braved the conditions Saturday to compete in the first ever Big Bam Vertical Slam race. The course took racers to the top of the hill and down again, and then depending on your distance, the daunting task of going back up the hill again. I'm currently trudging up the backside of the Big Bam Vertical Slam route where runners will be coming down as they head towards the finish line at the base of the hill. And it should make for an exciting finish considering the steep muddy slope we've got right here leading right down towards the finish line. But almost all of the runners managed to get down the steep section without incident, granted some at different paces than others. And once they crossed the finish line, it was more of a sense of relief than anything. Race director Lori Cardinal said most people had a similar reaction. They found it very tough. <laughs> a couple of people told me that I was mean. Is it tough? Um, God. It is a very challenging course, uh, especially with the rain. It makes it a lot muddier up there. Oh, it's really challenging. Yeah, it's like no other race. Uh, it's not like a, uh, you know, kind of a, a run where you can just cruise into. Um, it's either like all out steep hiking or running all out. Big Bam Ski Hill President Jody Mather said he wasn't completely surprised that so many people signed up to do such a tough race. Well, runners are crazy, right? So, you know, they're like mountain bikers. They, they don't care. Rain, snow, doesn't matter. So it was kind of shocking that we did kind of get the numbers, but not really, I guess. <laughs> now the real question is, how many people will decide to do it again? Peter Houston, CJDC TV Sports, Taylor.